<laughs> Hello, don't say it. What's up, Doc? He said it. Are you okay? You seem a little jittery. Jittery? I'm not jittery. If anyone's jittery, you're jittery. I'm not jittery. So, do I have a clean bill of health? Everything looks fine. Great. See you next year. Whoa, whoa. There is just one thing. <gasps> I knew it. I knew you were hiding something. How long do I have? A year? A month? A day? Am I contagious? If I'm contagious, then those people need to know. You owe it to them. I'm highly contagious. Run for your life. <laughs> Why didn't you tell me sooner? What kind of a doctor are you? You're probably not even a real doctor. Syracuse? That's a basketball school. I was just gonna say that I think you should stop drinking coffee for a while. You have too much caffeine in your system. It's what's making you so tense. Oh, cut out coffee. No problem. <clears throat> you could probably just take this. Mm -hmm. All right, no caffeine. I'm sorry to bother you, but can I just have 30 seconds of your time to tell you about a product that could change your life? Sam. This product differs from other similar products because of its unique ingredients. I'm not interested. It's like coffee, but without the caffeine. What's like coffee? Spargle. While coffee leaves you feeling jittery, Spargle will leave you feeling rested and alert. When did you get into this racket? I needed money quick. They said they were going to take my house. I mean, I believe in the product. <laughs> Tastes weird. Those are the sparkler berries. <laughs> wow, could this be working already? I don't know. You won't catch me drinking that stuff. <laughs> I'll take them. How many? All of them. Judging. I mean, uh, it'll change your life. Here's your shelf. You know, for an additional 20 bucks, we'd be happy to install it for you. $20 to install a shelf? I want a Nobel Prize. I think I can put up my own shelf. Looks secure. Hmm, I guess I need to find a stud. Ah, here we go. Yep, that's the stud right there. Guess that wasn't a stud. Do you guys have anything to fill in a couple of tiny little holes? Barely anything. You mean spackle? Yeah, spackle. Some people call it spackle. Aisle 19. You having trouble putting up that shelf? What? No. I put that up no problem. Just hammered it right in there. Hammered? You used a drill, right? Of course. Drilled it right in there. Are the drills anywhere near the spackle? Well, the award will cover that. Oh, hi, Tina. Hey, picking up Daffy, date night. Oh, is that a Timmel? Huh? Oh, yeah, uh, that's my brand, Timmel. Is that what you said, Timmel? What you working on? Just putting up a shelf. Oh, that doesn't sound good. It's fine. I'm sure I just hit a stud. That's not a stud. You either hit your junction box or a water pipe. Thanks for your help. But I think I know what I'm doing. I mean, I won the Nobel Prize. There. See? What happened to the water? Guess it was your water pipe. So your bugs. Let me hear you say it again. I like it. That's it. Perfect. Sorry, Pinky. There's just something about him, a likability factor. I mean, this guy's okay, but I want to party with this guy. Let's take it again. 
Hey, Pinky. I'm sorry. Scooch to your left a little bit. Little more. 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 How's this? Perfecto. Name? Bugs Bunny. Crime? Well, some might say being too good looking. Nah, I'm just kidding. Contempt of court. Oh, no. I'm gonna be swimming in this. Do you have a belt or a sash? I'm about to meet a ton of new people, and I'd rather not look like a big fat traffic cone. See what I mean? That's a lot of orange. <laughs> Too shabby. I mean, it could use some accessories, uh, maybe a few pillows or some scented candles. I'm thinking this might be a problem. <laughs> eh, a little salty, but I gotta say, it's a pleasure having somebody cook for me. How can you be so relaxed? We're in prison! Jail! The big house! We're up the river! We're down the creek! We're two bricks short of a load! There's no I in team! You gotta fight for your right to party! Party's over. What are you scared of? This guy? I bet he's a teddy bear. I'm Bugs. This is Daffy. We're in cell 2R. Come by any time. The door's always open. Well, not technically, but you get the point. Anywho, uh, would you be a dear and uh, uh, please pass me the ketchup? Are you serving time for being rude or because you can't follow directions? <gasps> yeah, so let me get this straight. I can insult whomever I please without fear of bodily harm? I should have gotten thrown in jail years ago. It's a smart Alex paradise. Say, I like your hair. Did you butcher it yourself? Nah, I'll butcher you! I don't know where you got your looks, but I hope you kept the receipt. Oh, I'm gonna get you! Hey, buddy, can I borrow your brain? You're obviously not using it. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta get me out of here. I'm not cut out for this place. Look at me, I can't eat, I can't sleep. You don't know what it's like being cut off from the outside world. What year is it? Who's president? Uh, you, you've only been in here you believe, uh, one day. Well, it's been a very hard day. Did you know they have a yard here where you can exercise? For free? Well, before I go, I, I made you a cake. A cake, huh? <laughs> Nothing? No crowbar? No shiv? Who brings a cake to a prisoner without putting a means of escape inside? How do you expect us to break out of this place? <laughs> Mother. Ooh, where are we going now? You don't know anything about me. I bet if you look self-absorbed up in the dictionary, you'd find your picture. My picture's in the dictionary? Is it a good one? What am I wearing? Does my beak look big? Aha! Gotcha! <clears throat> this is hopeless. Don't get mad at me. Those questions were impossible. I bet you don't know when my birthday is. Your birthday is April 17th, your favorite color is Dusty Rose, and you go to bed every night at 10 o'clock, except on New Year's Eve, when you go to bed at 8.30, because, and I quote, New Year's is a holiday invented by the media. It is! Forget it. Find a different best friend to go on that show. But I need you. I prize prizes above all else. This is my shot at finally winning something. I'll do anything. Even if it means focusing on someone other than yourself for more than two minutes? That sounds awful. But I'll do it! Well, Daffy, you know how I hate to talk about myself. But, uh, Levis turned back the clock. It was on the east side of New York, where me parents resided amidst humble surroundings. Did I say New York? I meant the planet Krypton. Anywho, my parents knew that our planet was doomed. Shh. 
So my father, Jarrell, built a spaceship. His dense, molecular structure will make him strong. He'll be fast, virtually invulnerable. And he'll say, what's up, Doc, indiscriminately, whether he's speaking to a doctor or not. He will travel far, my little bugs. But we will never leave you. You're from the planet Krypton? No, you maroon. That's the story of Superman. Who is Superman? I can't believe I hitched my wagon to you. You have a wagon? Daffy, concentrate. On me! Oh, sorry, Superman. Ugh, really? You're really going there? Yeah, I'm going there. Where is he going? Because if you go there, I will go there. And you do not want to be there when I get there. Because when I get there, I will be so there that you will wish you had stayed right here. Me? What about you? You don't care about your neighbors. You're just scared one of them's going to sue you. <laughs> You're crazy. I'm crazy? You're the one who made carrot pie. I mean, carrot pie? Ever heard of carrot cake? That's an actual dessert made with carrots. And do you make it? No! You make carrot pie, a thing no one eats! This party blows. I'm going home. Well, I'm not going anywhere until I get an apology for everything this fool has done. I mean, turning a bunch of rats loose on Columbus Day. Who does that? The same jack and apes who darn near burned my house down. And by the way, you don't go accusing your neighbors of stealing something without any evidence, especially something as dumb as a newspaper. I mean, come on, read the internet. For the last time, I don't read it! Haven't anyone seen my parade float? You heard the witch, uh, I mean, lady. You owes us all an apology. Well, say you're sorry. Uh, you can't say it, can you? I can say it. Uh, then say it. I'm sorry. Did you just say you're sorry? I'm sloggy. You're soggy? I'm sorry. You're the worst neighbor I ever met. And I should know, before I met you, I was the worst neighbor I ever met. Eh, it's still a close call. Bucky, can I see you in my office? What I do? <laughs> Bugs, what are you doing here? I was gonna push Daffy off the roof. Wow, look at you. You got your own cubicle. A computer. Uh, please don't. A phone. Uh, 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 this is Porky Pig. Uh, Pencil sharpener. Uh, 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 Tape dispenser. Uh, 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 what a fun uh, job. You must love working here. If I uh, uh, love, you mean hate sitting in the soul-sucking cave, uh, uh, counting every minute until the uh, uh, weekend, uh, and then dreading every minute until the uh, uh, Monday, uh, uh, then yes, I uh, uh, love working here. Spitting image. Oh, uh, who works there? In no one. It's empty. Mm hmm I have so much energy. What to do, what to do, what to do. It's oily, but I guess I can make dinner. <laughs> hmm, now what? Oh, there's that book I always wanted to write. June, I don't think that's too early to put up Christmas decorations.
Merry Christmas! You get that shelf up? Shelf? <laughs> you must have me confused with somebody else. I'm a totally different customer. Never been here before. Just the saw? Uh, yeah. Oh, uh, I'm also gonna need a slip coupler. Oh, you got a cracked water pipe? Oh, yep. <laughs> you know how that goes. That water was pouring out when I left. You mean you didn't shut off the water main? Lola, I gotta get inside and shut off the water main, whatever that is. Winning the Nobel Prize? That's amazing! Lola, move it! I mean, no bells. None. I can't live without bells. I think my house is flooded. Wow. Someone wins the Nobel Prize and thinks they're pretty hot. Well, guess what? You're not, all right? All you did was not have a bell, okay? Anyone can do that. I can totally do that. Who am I kidding? No, I can't. Bells are so fun. What's going on, man? I was taking a nap. I almost drowned. I was trying to put up a shelf, and I drilled into a water pipe. Why didn't you just pay someone to put it up for you? I don't get it. I won the Nobel Prize. I think I can put up a shelf. Oh, the Nobel Prize, huh? What did you get it for? Making bad decisions? Telling you that you can now enjoy my pizza in a frozen variety. I like it. And you will too. Speedy Gonzalez's frozen pizza in your grocery freezer. Huh, how much? Oh, it's on the house. You're famous. Honey, look. I like it, guy. Say it. I like it. Yeah. I like it. You probably get this all the time, but will you say it? I'm kind of in a hurry. Please, just one time. I like it. Do you mind, will you say it for my outgoing message? I like it. Oh, was it recording? One more time. I like it. Woohoo! I like it! I'm not sure I like it. Say it. Yeah, you. I like it, guy. Say it. I like it? Classic. <laughs> Stonehenge, one of the oldest structures in the world. Low light. Was it the Druids who built it? Or aliens? Hmm? The world will never know. It's the Eiffel Tower. The world will never know. Oh my gosh, hurry! We only have two more hours left in Paris and we haven't fallen in love yet! Wait, have you fallen in love yet? Okay, well quit staring at Stonehenge and let's see the rest of the city! Give me my spoggle! I said put it down! Come off! 
Doing a little home improvement? Oh, you know. Just tinkering with a few little projects. Nothing big. Just replacing the ceiling. An entire wall. Most of the floor. Maybe put in a new support beam or two. That'll be $2,865.43. Say what? My house! Hey! Hey, see, I like it, guy! You live here? Say it! My house is burning down! That's not the line! Turn on the water! No, you remember! The little mouse goes, what do you think, sir? And you say... I like it! Woohoo! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, when you're done, can we get a picture? I may have missed out on high school, but I got to go to one heck of a high school reunion. Oh, home movies from my unconventional youth. I haven't seen these in a while. You were the president of Mexico? Eh, interim. You did all that instead of going to high school? Do you know what this means? <laughs> you peak too soon! <laughs> Meh, I don't think I've peaked quite yet. 